So here we've got our spectrum. So that's here our frequency index. And that's here x of k. And so remember our discrete spectrum looks like that n minus 1 to 0. So these are that's our symbol in the frequency domain. Yeah, so all these xk's here they are xk contain quam coded coded data what we discussed before. So now what we do is so we add in the spectrum here fixed xk so they always have the same value. Yeah, so so we set this xk here let's say this is here xk of let's say 30 or something like this and we're setting this to 2. And obviously we, so we do the same for the other ones here. These are other case, so that's here maybe K20, K and K10 or something like that. Um, so that's K10, and let's say this is here K, no, that's K20, and that's here K, K10, for example. So we're setting these ones to, to constant values. And these are the so-called pilot tones. So obviously we need to reserve for this more bandwidth because they're pushing the spectrum aside. So these are pilot tones and they have noun amplitude and phase. So here we have amplitude 2 Amplitude is 2 and phase is 0 degrees. So essentially we have um, a pure real number. So now we just need to need to have a look what's happening to these pilot tones on the receiver side. <coughs> 